been a I've been in and out of the hospital for a while. Um, for a, for a, a drug addiction and various I, I was I was in rehab and um, I would spend a few weeks on sofas on friends sofas or or not friends sofas or anyone who you know sort of had me for as long as I could um, get away with and then uh, end up back in hospital or on um, park benches um, for a, a few and I, I didn't, I wasn't in contact with my parents, my, 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 my father, um, we, just my father, my mother was, um, was dead by that point, which, um, I suppose was the, uh, trigger for the, um, for the drugs, for the heroin and, uh, others, for all of it, with all of it, um, Because that was the moment that I, 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 um, I mean, I, I suppose then I suppose the moment I, I, I overdosed, um, this guy um, found me because I, I'd left my door open and, um, I would leave my door open regularly, um, not, not on, not like consciously, but, um, because I suppose my, my therapist says that it was some survival instinct that kicked in or something something about um timing because that wasn't the first time wasn't by any sort of, sort of stretch of um but i i suppose because i was ready this particular time um that it was a good thing i could turn this into a good thing and i and i, I mean it was good timing because i i I had these abscesses. I had an abscess on my leg. They, they thought I might lose my leg, and uh, the pus had sort of built up. And and I I didn't give a shit. You just don't give a shit. And my leg had sort of swollen to twice its. Um, and there's this doctor, whose whose face I I I can't and. Um, he set up a drip and and a, a surgery, but but all I could all you can think about is is just to drain the fucker and let me get back out to um, I was injecting between my toes and I had my shoulder and my, my groin and I wasn't really holding on to any sort of um, I couldn't fake it. Or, or hold on a job, or I, I mean, I was fired from, um, there wasn't any stability. I didn't have any stability. I, I couldn't define stability for you. If you asked me, I, I couldn't identify it when your mother just, um, it's just, uh, it's the opposite of stability. I, I don't think that I seek it or sought it. I um I I suppose I just I, I had this thought in me that if my mother couldn't then then I must be an almighty piece of shit because I I I I mean what happened was it was the opposite of an it's not even what you asked me. Um Yeah, I, um, I, what I wanted to explain how I ended up in rehab, um, I have a degree, <laughs> that's not, um, I was, I was in, 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 in rehab and that's directly connected to here because there was this guy that I met there and, and this, this, he, in there and he, um, he was, he's, he died that he told me about here and he used to talk about it with such peace and um, I'm not really I'm, I'm not and I have a 
total aversion to that kind of but I, I couldn't I couldn't go back to my dad's because I, things are just um, well they're getting good now but um, before all this the, the overdose I, I he picked me up from the train and um, it was a last ditch attempt I think and I was fucked like properly fucked he was driving and I thought he was somebody else. I, I thought he was a, a, a dealer or a, a, some bloke in a jacket who was new and I, I could get something off of this guy. So I started hitting on my dad. Um, I, I, um, he just, um, So when I heard, when he told me, when I heard about here, um, when I heard about the garden and the uh, hills and the, um, the greenhouse and the chickens and the field and the um, fruit trees, I just couldn't stop thinking about it. it would not be right and calm and like I was small again in a good way My mother's name was Carol. <laughs>